This is Minute Mask Tip 7 of 10 with Jeremy Schuback. If you pull from a green screen, you're left with color spill, a nasty green edge that's reflected from the background. To get rid of it, turn the mask back into a selection by holding Command and clicking on the mask. Then go to Select Modify Border and set it to a wide enough width to contain all of the green, but not too much more. I'm using 35 here. Feather it so it has a nice soft edge. I'm feathering by 10 and then create a hue saturation color adjustment layer. If you crank the saturation, you can see it affects everything. To have it just affect the layer below it, hold down Alt and click the line between those two layers to create a clipping mask. Set saturation back to zero and then change master dropdown to green. Blast up the saturation and if not enough green is selected, adjust this bottom bar. Then decrease the saturation to bring down the greens and shift the hue in hopes of matching your final background color. Yes, there are other methods, but this is a great first step for fixing color spill. This is just a small clip from my larger class, How to Use Masks in Photoshop, from beginner to expert in less than two hours. If you're interested, click the link below to sign up. After having taught over 100,000 people Photoshop, both live and online, I promise it's $29 that will save you years of frustration using Photoshop with far slower methods. $29. That's less than a cup of coffee. I live in the Bay Area.